probably already know, we love diving into mythology. Greek, Persian, Malaysian, Japanese, Hindu. The list of the many mythos we love to explore is quite extensive. Our appreciation for mythology isn't just delegated to Top 10 Archive. Like many of our viewers, we also enjoy dabbling in fictional and exaggerated versions found in a large selection of video games. This list of 10 is among our favorites when we need our mythology kick, eh, but don't feel like reading. Looking for your own frequent dose of mythology? Be sure to subscribe now and click the bell for notifications on future videos. Are you a gamer and have a few suggestions of your own? Let us know in the comments, and if you like this video, be sure to give it a like. Number 10. Tomb Raider Considering the many lands that adventurer and raider of tombs Laura Croft visits during her gaming career, she's bound to happen upon mythological references and figures along the way. Throughout the series, Croft has squared off against many beasts, inspired or pulled from ancient mythology, such as Egypt's Amut in Laura Croft and the Temple of Osiris, and various references to Norse mythology in Tomb Raider Underworld. Croft has also stumbled into Aztec, Japanese, and Grecian folklore, often represented by puzzles and texts discovered by the Tomb Raider. Number 9. Max Payne the focus of Max Payne is a disgraced DEA agent and former NYPD officer who's on a quest to seek justice for his slain family. Though the third person shoot em up, which essentially introduced bullet time into gaming, seems like your classic run of the mill revenge story, it's speckled with hints to Norse mythology. The drug responsible for Max's losses, Valkyr, references the Norse figure responsible for deciding who lives and who dies in battle. There's also mention of Ragnarok, the Norse version of the end and rebirth of the world. Asgard even makes an appearance as a building used as a meeting place for a secret society. Number 8. Titan Quest This one-off from now-defunct video game developer Iron Lore Entertainment was originally released in 2006 for PC. More than 10 years later, it's still popular enough to warrant an iOS and Android release and a port to the PS4, Xbox One, and Switch. The Diablo-style gameplay and design worked well to bring to life the world of Grecian mythology, which was conceptualized by Brian Sullivan, designer for Age of Empires. Titan Quest features a host of mythical beasts from Greek mythology in a story revolving around lesser titans and the salvation of Olympus. Number 7. Dante's Inferno Loosely based on Inferno, from Dante Alighieri's Divine Comedy, Dante's Inferno amps up the blood and nudity as players control Crusader Dante as he traverses the nine circles of hell. Marked by death to damnation for his many sins committed during the Third Crusade, after his assassination, Dante defeats death, learns of his wife's murder, and descends into hell to save his beloved's soul from Lucifer. The digitized version of the Nine Circles are filled with grisly creations and recognizable figures from Alighieri's depictions of Hell. Players will float along the River Styx, break into the City of Dis, make their way through Purgatory, confront King Minos, Judge of the Damned, and slay Cerberus, the Hound of Hades. Number 6. Darksiders Centered around the Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse and, unsurprisingly, the Apocalypse itself, Darksiders takes elements from the New Testament and puts gamers in the shoes of war. Summoned to bring order to a war-torn world no longer inhabited by humanity or watched over by the forces of heaven, war sets out to clear his name after being accused of causing an early apocalypse. Darksiders introduces elements from the Bible including the Garden of Eden, the Tree of Knowledge, the Angel Azrael, and the End War or Last Judgment. Number 5. Okami Clover Studios' action-adventure game, Okami, pulls its title character straight from Japanese mythology. Set in classical Japan, player's player is Okami Amaterasu, the Japanese goddess of the sun, who appears as a white wolf. The game's title also refers to the Japanese white wolf, an extinct species of wolf that, in local folklore, was associated with the mountains and was thought to be both a benevolent and malevolent force. Amaterasu descends upon Nippon to remove a curse set upon the land by Orochi, the eight-headed demon. The journey is speckled with nods to Japanese mythology, including wood sprites, Suzanu, the Shinto god of the sea, and Kushinada Hime, 
the Shinto goddess of rice and wife of Susano. Number 4. Digital Devil Story, Mega Tensei. In 1987, video game developer Atlas introduced gamers to Digital Devil Story, Megami Tensei, a role-playing adventure set in a world ripe with demons and references to such mythical characters as Lucifer, Loki, and Izanami, Japanese goddess of creation and death. Rather than focus on one mythology, Megami Tensei and the subsequent series of games that followed touches on a host of different regions to create the extensive roster of enemies and key players. In the 1987 RPG, players control Akima Nakajima, the reincarnation of Izanagi, a Japanese god born of the seven divine generations, and fight against demons pulled from Egyptian, Greek, and Christian mythologies. Number 3. Hellblade – Senua's Sacrifice When Ninja Theory independently developed and produced Hellblade – Senua's Sacrifice, it did so with the intention of tackling the issue of mental health and internal suffering. On the surface of Senua's journey to save the soul of her deceased lover is a hefty use of Norse mythology. The start of the Picked Warrior's quest takes her to the border of Helheim, or the Nordic Underworld. Ninja Theory imbued the game with legends like that of Grarm, the sword used to kill the dragon Fafnir, and Valraven, a supernatural raven rooted in Danish folklore. Aiding Senua are the Furies, or the whispering voices in her head, which are more connected to Greek mythology as three female deities of vengeance. Number 2. God of War It's impossible to mention the word mythology in a video game discussion, and for the God of War series not to come up pretty quickly. The original series, which spanned four console and two handheld releases, not including HD collections or mobile games, follows tragic Spartan warrior Kratos on his literal war against the gods of Olympus. Zeus, Hercules, Athena, the Kraken, and Medusa are just a small selection of the many mythical figures in the God of War series, and the list will only grow when Kratos takes on Nordic figures in the Warriors 2018 return. Number 1. Age of Mythology If you know gaming at all, you probably knew this was going to be in the number one spot. In fact, any fewer than several dozen predictions in the comments is simply unacceptable. Spun off from the popular Age of Empires real-time strategy series, mythology sends players across multiple mythos, including Greek and Egyptian, as an Atlantean admiral and war hero. Along the way, players square off against Kraken, Minotaur, Cyclops, and Centaur in a rather robust tale that involves Zeus, Loki, the Trojan Horse, and War Against Troy, Agamemnon, and Osiris. Thanks for watching. Know of some other games which make use of mythological figures or places? Tell us about them in the comments.